Another banger. Baby, calm down, calm down. Yo, this somebody he put in my heart for lockdown, for lockdown, oh lockdown. Yo, you sweet life, Fanta, Fanta. If I tell you, say I love you, you know they for me, Yanga, oh Yanga. Do not tell me, no, 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 no. Whoa, 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 whoa. today maybe about like 30 minutes ago um so i just wanted to check in and give y'all a room tour um this is my first official vlog ever so y'all go easy on me but this is my first vlog and i'm so excited to be vlogging my whole trip to arupa and i'm so excited to be here and i thank god for allowing me to see and experience everything that he has created so let's get right into this room tour y'all Okay, so I am staying at the Rio Palace in Tila's. Um, so I have the Dream Suite Ocean View. So, yeah, let's get started. Okay, so here's the bathroom. Toilet. Big, nice mirror. Nice walk in shower. It has a waterfall, y'all. And I cannot get my hair wet. But it has like another shower head that I can use. And then a his and her sink. Front door. Full size mirror. Got a fridge. Let's see, got already drinks in it, water, sodas, pop, um, coffee, here goes some drinks y'all, y'all know we about to get lit, period, but here's some drinks, little nice sitting area, you know, okay, let's go ahead and get into this king size bed, I'm a chunky girl, so I need all my space. This is so cute and adorable. That's so cute. But yeah, it's nice, comfy. Nice size bed with some nice stands. A little sitting area. So this resort, y'all, is all inclusive. Everything's included. All free alcohol, food. Uh, beverages just everything so yeah and let's go ahead and get into this breathtaking view my lord this is gorgeous this is beautiful y'all it's like a little construction over there but you can't even hear it and then Oh yes, 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 ma'am. Rio Palace and Tila's gorgeous view. I'm right next to Eagle Beach. I think that's like the second most beautiful beach in the world and number one in the Caribbean islands. That's what they said earlier. Gorgeous. They got some boats over there. Uh, parasailing. Everything's included, y'all, so... Okay, 
y'all. So that's the room tour. I'm actually about to go ahead and eat something. I haven't ate all day. I was at the Atlanta airport all day, y'all. You already know how it is. I was in TSA for about three hours, so I am tired as hell. So I'm about to go ahead and grab me some good to eat. So I will see y'all when I get right down there. All right. Okay, y'all. So I got some rice and some type of meat. It looks like some type of beef. And I got me a glass of wine. I'm at the buffet. I'm ill part in the evil nigga from the I ain't got a word but I'm full nigga chin and I'm S I N G L E a kidney Y'all fine hanging out the window in my right shit A is from the gun ill part in the evil nigga from the I ain't got a word but I'm full nigga chin and I'm S I N G L E a kidney Y'all fine hanging out the window in my right shit A is from the gun I am back so I have not been vlogging all day because you know like the day of travel when you get like first get to your resort you like be like super tired so we took a nap today um I still haven't ate yet but we're about to get ready and go ahead and go to dinner but um I'm not gonna eat on the resort today we actually have reservations for Gianni's and so we're about to go ahead and walk there um yeah, so I just have on a simple black dress. Um, I got this purse from Target. And then, let me show you guys. <clears throat> and I just got some nice shoes from Target. And these came from Target. Yeah. And these came from Target. So, I'm about to go ahead and head out, you guys. So I'll see you guys at Gianni's. Peace.
There you go. You say you eat them back at home? Yeah, did me. <laughs> There you go, man. Hey, Jay. Name you Jay. They're going to AT. Well, they call it UTVs here, guys. <laughs> Everybody's scared to feed them. <laughs> you see? Oh, I'm not going close. Hey, man. Hey. Watch out. I know. That's what I said. It doesn't hurt, but. There's some more animals over there. I'll give you 20 bucks if you let it eat I'm out your hand. I don't care if you give me a hundred bucks. I don't want it. I won't even have a hand, man. What's stopping that thing from just jumping over and jumping? I know. He can eat out my hand. Aww. Are these donkeys? Good boy. Or girl. Here, I got one more for you. You ain't gonna make your stomach feel good. Hey, Oh, I thought that was really warm. Ow. <laughs> oh my. It's saying it's hungry. Is this a goat? Yeah. Nothing to discuss, oh, cause I'm the poor by default I'm without any doubt, oh I'm a me happy adult, oh I look off it, I look off it, I go it's out, oh I'm a mind as you can talk, oh I put my life into my job and I know I'm in trouble She manipulate my love, oh mm, I know holy, and I know that they care for That the baba fry, oh My eye, oh, don't cry, oh He said this is the first um first chapel going to the church. Chapel thing you built ever built. And they, the people came from South America, right?
We don't cast Last, last Now everybody go to our breakfast Shayo 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 To go bow for the result Nothing to discuss Cause I did win by default I'm without any doubt I'm a me happy at all I don't go feed the dog I don't go feed the dog is out I'm a mind that's you the dog I put my life into my job And I know I'm in trouble She manipulate my love I know holy And I know that care both Like if I have I did what I got when then kills Obama I did try to buy moto, want Toyota Corolla My feelings been this swing like Django Lover Feelings been this swing like Django Lover Now you crash your Ferrari for Lecky Bona Hey guys, I am back at the resort, thank God. Um, I can't really talk long because they're playing music, but I'm at the pool. It's like kind of like a pool party. Um, UTV was nice, tiring, it was about four hours, and it was like really rocky. Um, but I can't really talk, so I might have to do a montage. Um, yeah. So I'm just up, relaxing by the pool, soaking up some vitamin D. So, I guess I will see y'all at the beach. I'm ill, bald, and you eat full, nigga, free, full. That mean I ain't got a very bountiful, nigga, cheap. And I'm S I N G L E again. I'm fine hanging out the window with my wretched ass friends. I'm ill, bald, and you eat full, nigga, free, full. That mean I ain't got a very bountiful, nigga, cheap. And I'm S I N G L E again. I'm fine hanging out the window with my wretched ass friends. So we just left the pool and stuff. Um, we went ahead and ordered some room service. It's not much of an option on the room service. Let me turn this down. Okay, so we went ahead and ordered some room service. I got some fresh fruit and then I just got some nachos with cheese. Um, and I just got me a spray and some stuff. What you get? The cheesecake? Red velvet cheesecake? I don't really eat dessert like that, so... I thought it was a uh, red velvet. Red velvet. Red. Oh. <laughs> okay, so yeah, we're about to go ahead and snack on this until it's time for dinner. And then, um, yeah, we're supposed to be going to the steakhouse around 6.30. I think it's about 5 o'clock right now. So we're probably just about to relax because we are tired from the UTV and the, um, you know, being at the pool and beach all day. So I just got out the shower and stuff. That's why I'm not showing me because I'm, you know, I have no clothes on. But all right, I will see y'all when I'm getting dressed for the steakhouse. Hey y'all, so we are currently um, in our hotel room waiting for the beeper to go off for the steakhouse we had to make a reservation because that's like the popular spot at the resort so my boyfriend said like the line was like outrageous it was like all the way in the uh sand and so now we have to wait he went down there around like 6 15 p.m so we just like sitting in our hotel room just chilling you know waiting for the beeper and they told us about 86 minutes that we'll have to wait and um and if we don't come within those 15 minutes then our spot get taken away so um so if you guys ever do come to the rio palace and tila's make sure you guys try to hurry up and beat the line and try to go reserve a spot for the steakhouse on the thing it's in our reservations but i mean they let everybody else reserve so you know we went ahead and reserve our spot and i i hope they're good because the way is ridiculous, but you know, it won't. You know, it won't hurt to try. So, um, so we just sitting here. 
I was like literally like looking at the bathroom how my scalp is so red it got burnt when we was doing the UTV writing earlier and then we was at the beach and pool all day so it even got more red and I didn't know like my scalp can't even do that because you know I'm a dark skin girl but you know I wear my sunscreen by the way but you know I wear my sunscreen every day faithfully in the winter, fall, most definitely summer, and I reapply it, well I try to reapply it every two hours, and yeah, so even my arms, you can even t like tell, I have like a tan line, you can't really tell probably, but yeah, even my arms got like a nice tan color to it. I've been seeing like all the girlies on TikTok be tanning, you know, like my skin complexion, darker, and I'm here for it because I love it. I love being real dark, so. Alright y'all, so whenever we get to the steakhouse, I will make sure to show you guys my food and I will let y'all know how I liked it, if it's worth the wait, you know, we'll see. So I will see y'all when I get there. So, okay, so I really don't have a good stand for my, um, okay, so I don't really have a good stand for my camera. Um, I already told you guys I'm new to vlogging, so please forgive me, and I'm hoping this vlog comes out okay. I am a little nervous because this is my first vlog. And hopefully I do want to be able to do this full time, you know, being a content creator. So um, this is my outfit for the day. Well, for the night, I'm just wearing a dress that I got from Shein. I can't really even show you guys. And then I have this bag from Shein. Um, so yeah. And then I got on some white shoes. And then, you know, just this blue dress from Shein. Okay, y'all, so hear me, y'all. I had changed clothes because I did not feel comfortable in that blue dress. It kept rising up, and I'm already a chunky girl, so I didn't feel comfortable in it. Um, I will talk to you guys later um, about why I didn't feel comfortable. I know this is supposed to be a Ruba travel vlog, but I also have PCOS, so I kind of want to talk about that um, and let you guys know why I didn't really feel comfortable in that dress. It is a cute dress, don't get me wrong. And I love the color on my skin complexion. Um, let's see. Yeah, I just couldn't wear it. So I just put on this. You can't even really see it. Just a green maxi dress from um, Shein. I'm still going to do the same bag. And then I have a Travis size Glu Gucci. I say Gucci. I have a Travis size Gucci Flora. It doesn't really last long. But it smells so good to me. So, I'm just gonna. I need to get a wide angle lens, y'all, because this. I should have listened to YouTube because they told me with the Sony ZV1 to get a um, wide angle lens. And you can't even see the whole. My whole outfit or anything like that. So, I need to invest in one. I have everything for my camera. Um. Oof. Why did I spray that on my scalp? And my scalp is already burning. But yeah. Um. So yeah. So I just wanted to check in with you guys. We still have not received the beeper yet. So um. I thought we did. But we didn't. So we'll see. Alright. How would you guys how would you guys feel if I started talking more about um, polycystic ovary syndrome um, for sure PCOS how would you guys feel about that I don't really see much channels about that um, I want to include weight loss about it you know ideas and ways to lose weight and stuff you know women like kind of like a support 
group slash channel for other women that's struggling with weight gain with like you know going through the same thing that I'm going through um you know it's a little bit more hard for us to lose weight and I'm not even gonna lie to you guys I am having a hard time on vacation I used to be like really skinny I was like 140 ish pounds in high school um my mom is the one who diagnosed me she's an NP but I have been having like a really hard time trying to find like really cute clothes on me and so I'm like I've been kind of sad but I also been like really enjoying myself but um I don't know I'm I don't know Good morning guys. Today is Wednesday. It's around like 11-ish a.m. Um, here's the views for today. I was like really worried about this construction next door, but I don't even hear it like when I first pick up or like even when I'm on the beach, I don't even hear them working. I just hear the sounds of the beautiful ocean. I wish I could zoom in. I don't even know how to zoom in on this camera. I'm still like learning it. But look how beautiful the water looks this morning. For some reason, it just looks extra beautiful. Man. God did his thing when he was creating this earth, I promise you. So I just wanted to say good morning. I thank God for another beautiful, blessed day. Um, for allowing me to wake up this morning. Allowing me to see beautiful experiences. Um... So yeah, I just want to say good morning to you guys. Um, we're probably about to go down to the beach and then we have reservations at Flying Fishbone. Um, so I didn't even get a chance to show you guys the, um, the steakhouse last night, but they were actually really, like, really pretty good. Um, I feel like it was worth the wait. Um, let's see. So yeah, um, I'm about to go ahead and get dressed and yeah, I'll see y'all when I get there. Y'all, so today, like, we didn't really have that much plans today, uh, besides flying fishbone. Um, I think tomorrow, I kind of want to, you know, go to the, um, I think it's like a Haitian, I think, yeah, I think online they said it's like a Haitian population here. I think it's called St. Nicholas. So, they be telling people not to go there, but I heard this whole island is completely safe, and I'm a risk taker, so... Um, I think tomorrow we might rent a UTB or try to get a Jeep or something or just any type of car and we might take a drive to St. Nicholas and they also said like they have like really good jerk chicken so that's what I've been wanting that's what I've been having a taste for some jerk chicken uh, or even some jerk oxtails so I was just thinking that we could rent a car tomorrow and go drive up to St. Nicholas and you know see some of the I think it's called the Merrill's Merrill's Morals, like where all the drawings and stuff is at so um we're just gonna rent a car tomorrow and then you know just kind of explore the whole island because i'm the type of person that like, i like to get out the resort i'm a i'm a to-go person <laughs> so yeah i'm thinking we're gonna do that and then we might even i know for sure we're gonna do jet skis tomorrow and then um today is just kind of a chill day i don't know why i'm still so exhausted from the like the traveling you know from Atlanta to here um so yeah so we probably just gonna do this today it's just flying fishbone and then just chill at the resort again it's our second full day while we're here um I think we have wait today's Wednesday so yeah we have Thursday and Friday for like the last full day so um so yeah we have still like some things to do and then tomorrow for dinner, we have passions on the beach. It's like a beach dinner. And then um, we might even go out. Our resort has a decent club. It plays all types of music. But it's this place that I saw on TikTok and YouTube. Um, it's called South Beach. Um, I watched one of my favorite vloggers, Rebecca. She had uh, been to South Beach and looked like they enjoyed themselves. So... Yeah, so I will make sure, I will promise you I'll make sure I vlog that, all that type of stuff. I feel like I've been a bad vlogger, even though this is my first vlog, so, so yeah, forgive me, y'all, uh, but yeah. So I'll see you guys later. You guys can't really see me because the lighting is not that good, 
but I just have on this simple dress from Shein. Um, then I have my white shoes from Target. And then I believe this purse is from either Target or H&M. I cannot remember. And then I just have on the set of the day, Bellatino. I don't know which one it is. I'm not even sure. But it smells really good to me and it lasts all day. Um, so yeah, I just have on a simple dress. It's very stretchy and it's like really comfortable. So yeah, and I like the little pieces at the bottom. And these white shoes are like really comfortable too. So yeah, very simple look, very simple makeup look. Mm, yep. So I will see y'all when I get there. So yeah. Hey guys, so we're in the car on our way to Flying Fishbone. Um, we're just taking a taxi there and we should be there maybe about 15 minutes. So yeah, I just want to take you guys along with me because I feel like I've been vlogging enough. So um, I might do like a small montage throughout like showing the town and stuff. So I'll see you guys. I know. I heard it's prettier like around the sunset time. Is this always the time we go down? What time is it? It starts, their sunset here is like 6 15. So two hours from now. Yeah. But I heard the service is like a little slow here. Really? But like to like reserve this spot for like the feet in the water, it's like 4 o'clock. You have to do the 4 o'clock. So. 
I don't know. They both sound good. Hi, good evening. Hi, good evening. How are you guys doing today? Good, how are you? Good. Doing great so far. I was on vacation here. It's going good. It's nice. All right. My name is Edward, and I'll be your server this evening. Okay. Let me explain a little bit of the menu. On the menu, we're having two specials today: the fish of the day and the special of the day. Fish of the day today is the local fish, red snapper. Snapper itself is more of a firm fish. You can compare a little bit with the mahi mahi fish. Snapper comes fully on the grill with some mashed potato mixed vegetables and the creamy white wine sauce. You can add shrimp to it, but costs a little more. The special we have today is a unicorn fish. Unicorn fish is a fish from Hawaii. It's a very white light and flaky fish. Okay. Special self comes fillet on the grill with some mashed potato mixed vegetables and the creamy white wine sauce. The special self comes with three New Zealand mussels added to it. Okay. On the drink menu, we have the cocktail of the day. The cocktail of the day is the Savanita Salsa. It consists of rum, amaretto, peach snap, grenadine, pineapple juice, served on rocks. Okay. You guys would like to start off with something to drink? I mean, neither of I'm just going to take water for now. Yeah, water, water. Uh, have in mind already what the world uh, name for appetizers? Yeah, kind of, unless you have uh, I'll probably need a minute. Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> so see the menu's couple oh, minutes. If you have any questions, like oh, any recommendation, just let me know. Okay. okay. All right. Thank you. Right. I might just do the grilled shrimps. I don't know what I want. I'm such a picky eater. Yeah, you really do. I got a steak. Huh? Steak. What kind of? Well, see, we're going to LG Steak, LG Smith Steakhouse. So. That's tomorrow. On Friday. Yeah, so. You don't want a steak today? What they got? I was thinking of some type of pasta. Pasta. I just. Oh, this. They got a vegan pasta. Yeah. It's coming up. It's going to go up. They got creamy mushroom. Yeah. I don't see no other pasta. Oh, this is appetizers. Oh, sure. I don't see any other pasta. They have seafood pasta, but I don't eat mussels. I don't eat calamari. I don't eat the scallops. Herb. Get, get what you don't eat out. <laughs> what do you think about getting? Mm. I do love these oil. I like all of those things on the switch. I was thinking about getting that. Oh, this looks good. The chicken, so cool. Porto Billo. Grain fed chicken breast with pasta and creamy mushroom truffle sauce and roasted porto bello. I was thinking about getting the beef teriyaki. We did. I might get that. Really? Should I not? I think I'm just going to get this. I'm going to get the beef teriyaki. I like I like I don't like tomato solo, but I like something with it. This works. Okay. Marinated? Yeah. Yeah. It's yeah. not going to be as good as uh, a skewer, I guess. Yeah. I, still, I want, yeah. That's what I mean. I still want some kind of salad. So this is grain, grain fed chicken roasted pasta and creamy mushroom, truffle sauce and roasted portobello. I know.
Okay, guys, so they just brought out our um, appetizer. We got the deep fried calamari. I never tried calamari before, and then they gave us some sauce. Um, so, wish me luck. Like a brick, right? Yeah. I was oh. like, damn. No, no, no. Not like a brick. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. Okay, here's the calamari, y'all. Try it with the sauce. Fur. What is it, octopus or squid? And they're so happy. They call me that. They It's a chicken salad. <laughs> Swimming with the fishes. Oh. It's actually good. <laughs> Let me try it with the sauce. Well, who's your exterminator? I mean, that, that was uh, really personal. Yeah. The sauce is actually like, good. You could say, oh, Anthony's a douche. <laughs> you know? Yeah, I never really try new foods. It actually is good. It's good. You like it? It tastes like... I don't know. It's good. Well, yeah, our thing runs out. Yeah, it runs out. Oh, okay. You do have an exterminator. You can and a termite. Oh, wow. Well, when that was the deal with the house... Yeah, termites? They termite damage. Oh, okay. But they paid, so the sellers paid for like... A year of work. Which is the most expensive, and then every year Look. we do it's only like 200 years. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, he does just reset the traps the mm -hmm. in the ground. Whatever. Whatever. I'd rather have it than not. It's good, good job. I guess. I mean, true. That's the last thing we use. Yeah, that would be pretty devastating. And the season good. So you like it? It's just too much. Everything's good so far. Mm -hmm. It's delicious. Enjoy yes. it. Thank you. Um, yes, sir. What was she and what is it? Sir? Well, what is um calamari? Yeah. Oh, what's like around it? Mm -hmm. So it's uh the calamari is inside. It's like a uh, how we say this? Uh, you know when you cook uh, when you deep fry a chicken? Yeah. No, is it like octopus or? Oh, what what is calamari? Calamari is a, a squid. Oh. oh. Squid. Okay. That's what I thought. Okay. Enjoy it. Thank you. I mean to tell me I'm over here eating yeah, deep fried squid. I just want to make sure that was good. <laughs> I have a real here from my lap. I'm really happy with this. You okay sitting over there? I know. Well, that's some good ass squid. I have such a Yeah. But your cheek, your cheek's always good. Well, that's with everything. Oh yeah. I sweat. I'm out. Which goes I found this restaurant on TikTok. So thanks to TikTok for planning my whole trip. Okay guys, our food came. I got the chicken, portobello, pasta. What did you get again? Teriyaki chicken. It's good. Okay, so let me dig in. All right, y'all, let's try it. I'll change spots too, y'all, because it's a better view. You like your food? Mmm. 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 How you guys doing today? Perfect. It was, it's good. good. Yeah. Yeah. Enjoy, enjoy. Thank you. Mm. It wasn't good, right, sir? Who eat that fly? Oh, you trifling. Yeah. Terrible. <laughs> he laying over here, he gonna be calamari. Ugh. 
It's too many flies. Main these flies about to fight. This is a nice ass portion too. Freaking flies. Mmm. This chicken is bomb. I 100% recommend this restaurant. Customer service skills, a chef kiss, food is chef kiss. Everything just good. The view is breathtaking. I'm so messy. Thank you, bad bro. I noticed mm. mm. the teriyaki guy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Don't disturb me. <laughs> How can y'all eat crab legs? Okay. Hey y'all, I am back from um, Flying Fishbone. Y'all, that place was Chef's Kiss. I 100% recommend that place. So if y'all ever come to Aruba, please make sure y'all come to uh, Flying Fishbone. The um the waitress, not the waitress, the waiters and stuff like they were beyond nice. They so friendly and nice. Um, everything was just beautiful. The the view, just everything. I just loved everything about that place. So. Just make sure y'all go to Flying Fishbone. And um, so I'm not really doing nothing right now. I'm just like chilling. We'll probably go out tonight to South Beach. It's like a lounge. They play music and stuff. They got hookah for my hookah people, hookah girls, whatever. Um, so I'm just sitting here chilling. I'm watching Chelsea. Um, yeah, I'm just I'm just sitting here chilling, y'all. I ain't really doing nothing, but let's see but watching my girl. That's my favorite YouTuber, y'all. But yeah. Oh, shit. So yeah, I'm just like, just sitting here chilling. Just, you know, resting up. Pre-gaming and stuff. Probably about to take some shots and then, you know, get ready for tonight. It's about a five minute walk from our resort. So, not too bad. Not too shabby. Okay, so I will see y'all later on. I'm probably going to wear the same dress. Uh, yeah, probably going to wear the same dress. So, Okay, I'll see y'all later. Okay, guys, so we are just walking from the strip from our resort. And, excuse me, I'm out of breath. But here is like Fat Tuesday. It's a club right here called Gusto's Souvenir Shops. Oh, y'all gotta forgive me. This, this is a restaurant, like local shops and stuff. It's really pretty, like lit up here at night. Y'all can see the Rio Resort is just right there. A short little five minute walk. Um, yeah, so, and then, whew, a tattoo shop. And it's just some more stuff. And then South Beach is probably like two minutes from here, towards down. And then, yeah, so here's the club, Gusta, right there. And then Fat Tuesday is in the middle, right there. So, yeah, everything is cool and nice, y'all. So, and it's only Wednesday, so imagine like Friday or Saturday. So, all right, y'all. 
Good morning, guys. Today is what is today? Thursday. It's about 9 10 a.m. and um, I didn't get a chance to vlog South Beach. We kind of like left. We only stayed like 10 minutes. It wasn't anybody there. We went around like 8 o'clock. I think we went too early. So we went back to our resort and then we just went to the club here. Um, it was still playing all kinds of different music and stuff. It was okay last night. But I know tonight we're going to just go to Fat Tuesday. And then we're probably going to hit up South Beach again. Because I heard South Beach can get pretty lit. It's like a club or whatever. And then they also have another club called Gusto. Um, I think I shared it earlier on Wednesday, yesterday. I think I did vlog that or like showed you guys a little bit of that. But I know tonight for sure um, we're going to go to South Beach. But this time we're probably going to like go around 10 o'clock, maybe 9 o'clock so we can get us a good seat and get some hookah and stuff. And they play some really good music when we walk past and stuff. And then um, Fat Tuesday is a vibe too. So I recommend Fat Tuesday and South Beach for sure. I promise I'm going to make sure I'm going to vlog that. Or I'm going to at least get some type of clips of it or something. You know, I can't like vlog it because, you know, the music and copyright and stuff. So I'm just going to probably do a montage and like show y'all, you know, how they do and stuff at those clubs and stuff at Fat Tuesday. So, yeah, it's about 9-11 right now. It's Thursday. So we're actually about to go hit up the Dutch Pancake House. Um... I heard it's like one of those must-do's, like must-sees or whatever online and TikTok. So, um, I will see you guys when I get to the Dutch pen. Oh, okay. okay. so we just got back from the Dutch pancake house I really enjoy that place it was like the atmosphere and everything was nice the people were really nice it was kind of quiet which is a good thing because sometimes you need quiet while you're on vacation um the food was really really good I really don't eat pancakes but um I, my boyfriend got the Dutch pancake and I just got the waffles and it was really good the um the fresh orange juice, it was really fresh and if you could tell like it's real orange juice. You know, now no added sugars or anything like that. Um, <clears throat> and then we were downtown, we went to the mall and then that mall that I had showed earlier, that's the Renaissance Mall and like resort hotel and that's where Flamingo Island is at. We didn't get a chance to book Flamingo Island but next time I come to Arupa I will most definitely stay at that hotel. Because when I stay at the hotel, it'll be, you know, it's free if you stay at the hotel. But if you don't stay at the hotel, you can either book a massage or you can um, just get tickets every Saturday, I think, around 9 a.m. Um, just put on my black girl sunscreen. And then, um, let's see. I'm just reapplying my sunscreen, y'all. Whoever said black people um, don't tan or get darker. They a lie because I know I got about three to four shades darker. Um. Whew. 
And I like to put it on my hands because your hand can age, baby. Oh, child. Um, so yeah, so, so we, the plans for today is, um, did I get all of my sunscreen off? Yeah. Okay, so the plans for today is, um, we're about to get ready and do jet skis. We're just, we just came back in the house to cool off the house. We came back into the hotel to cool off and stuff because it's really hot out there. Like even my scalp is burnt. I didn't know my scalp can get burnt. That's crazy. Um, let's see. Um, so tonight, okay, so we're going to do Passions on the Beach for dinner. We booked a sunset dinner around 6.15. It's on Eagle Beach. And um, let's see. And then, like, later on, we're going to do, where else are we going to go? We're going to go to South Beach. We're going to get some hookah and stuff. I don't really do hookah, but I'm going to try it tonight. Um, and then we'll probably go to Fat Tuesday. And we might go to that club, Gusta. Um, let's see. What else are we going to do? Because I'll be forgetting, y'all. Especially when it's hot. You know when you get hot, you be so tired, man. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm hot. I'm tired. I'm sweaty. Um... Luckily, we're about to go get on the jet skis and cool off with that water. So, um, I'm not gonna put on my makeup because that is gonna spread right off. So, let's see. I think that's about it. So, yeah, jet skis and then dinner reservation on the beach, passions on the beach, on Eagle Beach, and um, South Beach Lounge and Fat Tuesday. And I might get a tattoo tomorrow. We'll see though. We got an appointment tomorrow, but yeah, I might get a tattoo tomorrow. I'm so scared because I don't have any tattoos. Everybody said it don't hurt. My boyfriend said it don't hurt. But he probably lying. He probably wanted to see me in pain. But yeah, so let's see. So yeah, I will see you guys when I get to the jet skis. I'm probably going to vlog it on my phone because I don't want to take my camera, so... Hey guys, we finally made it to Pashas on the beach. We almost didn't make it. We had started walking here and then um, it's been a journey. I have to tell y'all when I get back to the hotel room, but a stranger gave us a ride. She was a nice lady and she saw us walking. We was trying to find a taxi. We kept flagging down a taxi, but we finally made it. So, yes, I'm excited. All right, girls, also in a bit if you want, I can take you guys a nice picture with the sunset, all right? Okay, okay. oh yes, please. I have a question. Yes. Um, so I know you got... Anyways, guys, um, so there was a wait when we got here anyway, so they gave us uh, free champagne, which was really nice. It was on the house. Um, this is a really nice, it's a nice sunset. It's peaceful. They're playing music. I think it's like somebody 
playing like a violin, violin or something like that. But yeah, so just a nice romantic dinner. Let's see. Yeah. It's a nice atmosphere. So yeah, um, I'm probably about to order me a drink and see what they got, so I'll see you guys, um, it's like a lot of people staring at me and this is my first time vlogging so I'm already like a little nervous, so I'll see you guys, I'll show you guys my food, okay? Y'all, this sunset is so beautiful. Everybody's just up taking pictures. We just took ours. It's a vibe. And then when it gets dark, this is gonna light up. So y'all cannot wait. Pash is on the beach. I'm already loving it. Y'all, this place is a vibe. I love it. The sunset is beautiful. The waves. The people are just so nice here. I cannot believe we cannot find a taxi for my resort. These people are so nice here. And then it's a stranger. She came and picked us up. Don't be like me, y'all. Stranger danger. She was super nice. So. But yeah, this is a vibe for sure. Hi. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, oh, not. Nah. Okay. I'm a bottle guy. Oh, it's done. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, these people are so nice, guys. They gave us free champagne. Um, I just been in here order my drink. I got a sex on a beach. So pretty, right? You taste I don't drink beer. I already got a good. I don't want no beer belly now. But yeah, this is beautiful. This would be like a perfect place for a proposal. <coughs> Yeah, keep coughing. Hope you choke. Y'all, this place is gorgeous. Oh my gosh. It's a perfect place to spend a honeymoon, an anniversary, dinner, whatever. Proposal. So if there's any man watching this, if you got a girl or fiance, it's a perfect place to propose to her at. So yeah. Oh, uh, let me try this. Mm. One thing about Ruba, they sure gonna make these drinks strong. I feel like that's the whole Caribbean islands. This is good.
Yeah, just keep looking. You're gonna see like it's like close up to you. This it close? It might be a baby, but he'll come back up in a minute. This is a shark? Just watch the fin. Just keep looking. You see it poke up and poke down? Oh, sure, it is a shark. <laughs> this close? Yeah. I told you they come close. You see it keep poking up and coming? Mm hmm. He probably just a baby. Wow. You think it's the ones that be trying to... He a baby, he ain't gonna love He might, but... Uh, wow. People saw her swimming. She had a big on I saw the fin. <laughs> the rain gonna be out there. I know I went trip because I saw it, like, stay up for a minute, and I'm, I ain't even paying attention. Wow, we are like real like literally sitting on the second most beautiful beach in the world. Who the first? Shark doo 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 doo. Why are they playing this song while we seeing the shark? They must see it too. They're trying to let these people know get their ass about their work. Okay. <laughs> That's crazy. What if it was a dolphin? Nah, dolphins will jump up like that. And they fins are different from sharks. This might be yours. Why this drink gave me a buzz? Ready the pasta? Oh. It's a hot day, be careful. Alright, ready? Thank you. Let me show you guys my food. I got the chicken truffle pasta. Parmesan cheese on the side. Bon appetit, chef's kiss. Shabuya, sha, sha, shabuya. Your food good? Yeah, now let me, let me eat. What you get again? Shrimp pasta. Mmm. And salmon, right? Yeah. And look at over the ocean. Oh, it looks so nice. This is beautiful. God did his thing when he created this earth. Ooh, okay, I'm about to smash. Okay, let's take a bite, guys. Ooh, the wind. The wind is winning. Winding. Whatever them young girls be saying. That sex on the beach gave me a little buzz. This is beautiful, this whole sunset. Y'all, they think it's our anniversary. <laughs> oh, happy anniversary! It's your anniversary. Hey guys, so I'm about to go ahead and get ready for South Beach. Um, I got on the same dress from yesterday because I just feel comfortable in it. I got on my Shein earrings. They were only a dollar and ninety cents. Get you some. Um, I just did. Uh, I just refreshed on my makeup. Um, I just took another quick shower because I just felt sweaty. You know, sitting outside, bugs flying around and stuff. Um, so yeah, um, I just sprayed some of some of this Gucci. Can you see it? Some of this Gucci Flora, and then I mixed it with the um, Saint.
Saint Laurent. I have a small body size. I also have the big body size. Um, so yeah, so I will see you guys when I get to South Beach. I'm going to do a montage because they play music and I want to get copyrighted. And then I'm also, um, we're also going to do hookah, take some shots, you know, get some drinks or whatever. And, you know, just vibe out, listen to the music, just have fun because we only have one full day left. So I'll see you guys when I get there. Go to breakfast. Shayo. 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 To go out for the result. Nothing to discuss. Cause I win by default. I'm without any doubt. I'm a me happy adult. I no go feed the girl. I no go feed the girl. It's out. I'm a mind that's with the dog. I put my life into my job. And I know I'm in trouble. She manipulate my love, oh. I know holy, and I know that capo. Like if I have yo, I yo, don't cry yo. I need to go and shy yo, I need to go and shy yo, I need to go and shy yo, shy Hey guys, I am back from South Beach. Um, it's. 11:34. Um, I'm like a little tipsy, and that hookah was really nice. South Beach was really nice. Um, nice music. They play all kinds, like um, dance hall, reggae, hip hop, rap, all that type of music. Um, Spanish music. It was really nice. I 100% recommend South Beach. So if y'all ever come to Aruba. Please go to South Beach. I'm begging you. Go to South Beach. It's really nice. Um, we're actually going to go back. Tomorrow's our last day, so we're actually going to go back. Um, today is Thursday, so they close at 1 a.m. Um, and I know on Fridays, they close at 3 a.m. Um, so make sure y'all come to South Beach because it's really nice. The whole strip is like lit up. South Beach is on a whole strip like next to uh, Fat Tuesday. They got a whole bunch of uh, stuff down there. So make sure y'all check that out. And yeah, so I will see y'all in the morning because I kind of want to like pack up a little bit because I feel very disorganized. So I kind of want to like organize and everything because I hate feeling like that. And you know, so um, we're going to see what's the plans for tomorrow. So I will see you guys tomorrow in the morning. Good night. Hey y'all, today is Friday, April 28th. We've been here since Monday, April 24th. Today is our last full day being here. Y'all, we have not done shit all day today. Um, we went down for breakfast earlier, and then we went back to the room. We took our naps, and then we just laid around, watched movies all day. I know that sounds boring, but it was no point of like vlogging that. We didn't even go down to the pool, the beach, or nothing like that. You know how it is, like, on your last day on vacation, you just, like, super exhausted. Because we did, like, a lot of excursions. We got off the resort a lot. So we just kind of wanted to chill today. You know, vacation is a part of relaxation. So we needed, like, a little break before we, you know, before we go back to the real world. Back to work, paying bills and all that adulting stuff. So, um, so yeah, we haven't done nothing all day today. Um... So we'll probably, okay, so we're about to go to LG Smith's Steakhouse. And then we'll probably go back to South Beach just to get lit one more time before we leave. Um, and I think that's it. Our plane leaves tomorrow around 2.15. And then we're back home to Atlanta around 6 p.m. So, yeah. So I think that's about it. Um, this vlog might be like a little choppy. It is my first vlog, so y'all cut me some slack. And guys, please comment. Guys, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Another banger, baby, calm down, calm down. Yo, this somebody he put him out for lockdown, for lockdown, oh lockdown. 
girl use real life Fanta who, Fanta who If I tell you say I love you I'm not there for me Yanda who, oh Yanda who Not tell me no 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 one in the morning <clears throat> um so i just wanted to came in, came in. hey y'all i'm back i just left from south beach in um fat tuesday it was so nice um friday nights it gets so lit out there um it gets like super packed around like 11 p.m they don't close to 3 a.m and then like if you buy hookah um, you get a re, you get a, um one refill for free, and the drinks are super cheap. The drinks are really good. wasn't watered down. Um, Fat Tuesday was really nice. They also have hookah, like yeah, they have hookah there too, somewhere. Yeah. Um. Yeah, everything was so nice. It was lit. It was cool. They played like good music. They play like a lot of hip hop, rap music. Um, they play like reggae, dance hall. So I recommend, like, if you guys come to Aruba, I recommend coming on a Friday or a Saturday and come around like 11 p.m. And if you want to get like a good seat, I would recommend coming at like 10 p.m. You know, 10:30 ish, something like that. But it gets so lit, I ain't gonna lie to y'all. But um. So yeah, I just wanted to come on here and just close this vlog out. This is my first vlog and I'm so excited to be able to post it up. And I'm so excited to edit it. I'm just ready to share my experience with you guys. I hope this vlog is very helpful for you guys. Whoever's planning a trip to Aruba. Um, so let me know what you guys think about this vlog. Let me know if you guys have any questions. The best, like the best places for you guys to eat at or to stay at. Um, what else was I about to say? Yeah, Aruba is super nice. It's super beautiful. The people are so friendly. They are so friendly, y'all. I just love the Aruban people so much. They are just freaking friendly. I'm a little tipsy, y'all, so my speech is like a little blurred. But, um... So yes, guys, if you guys don't mind, please don't forget to comment, like, and please subscribe to my channel. That would be so helpful for me. Just please subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate you guys, and I hope you guys have a... Guys, I forgot to mention... Guys, I... Guys, I also forgot to mention, comment down if you guys also want me to start doing 
like polycystic ovary syndrome um, chit chat videos and if you guys want me to do like a Q&A video with my mom because she's a nurse practitioner if you guys want like tips videos weight loss goals because as soon as I get back from Aruba I'm on it summer's around a corner but I'm not even losing weight for summer just for summer I just need to get it off because I need it off not because of my parents well I ain't gonna lie a little bit of my appearance so I can feel better in clothes but also um you know just for my health you know to you know manage my hormones and stuff regularly um so like comment down if you guys want me to start doing um chit chat videos weight loss motivation vlogs whatever kind of videos you guys want just comment down below and let me know and I will see you guys in my next video. And I promise I will be consistent on YouTube with the polycystic ovary syndrome, aka PCOS. So I really love you guys. Even though this is my first video, I love you guys already. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Love you, beauties.